All right, Ms. Stuckel here. I wanted to take a few minutes just to walk you through what you're going to be doing as part of the formula writing module. Uh, this is our first module that is dealing specifically with chemistry content. So first of all, if you go to the formula writing overview, you'll get a text version of the things I'm going to talk you through. So our learning target for this module is I can use chemical formulas, formula names, and particle diagrams to describe compounds. So this is all about translating between different ways of representing a chemical compound. Um, now, in Chemistry Essentials A, you probably had some exposure to going between the formulas and formula names, um, but the particle diagrams are probably a new piece. So there's a few different things I'm going to have you work through. So your first task, I recorded a video where I go through a couple examples of how to go between names, formulas, and particle diagrams. So you can watch that, take a few notes. Then I've got some formula writing problems for you to work through. Um, I've got a list of formula names. I want you to get the um, formula and the particle diagram based on the name. Um, now, you can do this on paper or a whiteboard or whatever else you have access to at home. Uh, snap a photo and send it to me. Um, if you'd like to see how to um, do it on using something like Google Draw, let me know and I will be happy to chat with you about how to do that um, if that's what you prefer. Um, now, those problems are going to be due on Wednesday, April 8th. They are going to be graded in that formative category of the gradebook. And then on April 8th, I'm going to, or rather on April 9th, once you've submitted your answers, I'm going to go ahead and post my answers. Now, something I really want to emphasize is when I grade formative work, I'm not necessarily looking for correct answers. I'm looking for a reasonable attempt. So I want... If you make a reasonable attempt at all 10 problems, you will get full credit. And then once I've posted the answers on April 9th, you can use those to check your work. And then the next thing I'm going to ask you to do is a reflection. Um, I've got a few questions I want you to answer just about how this module went so that I can do some thinking through what do I need to change for the next module. You'll get a few points in the formative category of the gradebook for doing this. Um, this is something where I want you to be honest. Um, so uh, that will be your last formative task. And then I've got your summative assessment already posted. Um, I've got a chemical. I'm going to ask you to record a short video where you explain how to find the formula and how to draw the particle diagram. If you would rather do that in real time, um, so if rather than recording a video and submitting it, you would prefer to do a video chat with either me or Ms. P, um, go ahead and set up an appointment with one of us to do that. Uh, the last thing I'll point out, um, there are two things that will probably be useful this module. Uh, first up, I've got a link to a video that explains how to turn in photos and videos with your cell phone. Um, and so feel free to watch this to um, help make sure you know what you're doing when you're submitting that work. The other thing I want to point out, and this is something that I reference in that notes video, um, there is this document called Chemistry Formula Sheet. Um, this lists uh, just about all of the chemicals that we will be dealing with um, in formulas this trimester, uh, and it gives their symbol and their charge. It also has the polyatomic ions on here. Um, these are not things I expect you to memorize. On anything that I ask you to do, you are not only allowed, but encouraged to have this in front of you to um, see what you're doing. So that is the big things I'm going to be looking for you to do these next um, this next week and a half or so. Um, if you have questions, if you run into trouble, please let either me or Ms. P know and we'll be happy to help you out.